Hey, y'all never believe what I read about. <clears throat> I read that, hey, this guy trained a monkey. Okay, look, and then the monkey became a award-winning chef. What? He's booked for the next 10 years. Si, that's not real. This was on the cover of Life magazine. Oh, okay. I did a whole article about him, showed the, you know, his award-winning, yo, know, cookery that he done. Cookery. Cookery. <laughs> What does he cook? Uh, anything to do with bananas. <laughs> Speaking of all this, hey, I'm getting hungry. Where are we going for lunch? Y'all want to go to the diner? Eh, no. Mexican? Uh, the same old places. Hey, I got a place. Have you ever had a fried green tomato BLT? Think about it. Look, Galvin isn't exactly the most discerning individual when it comes to the culinary world. On a scale from one to 10, where does it rank? Ten. A ten? <laughs> However, that also means that he's tried just about everything. I don't know about frying a tomato. <laughs> Forget frying. That's what I said, too. So when it comes to finding new food to try, I trust the man with my lunch hour. We got to go. Where is it? In Vicksburg. Mississippi? Yeah. I mean, that's quite a lunch break, don't you think? Because it takes an hour and a half to get there. I'm in, except don't cook them. Don't cook them. It's a vegetable, OK? Don't cook it. It's a fruit. No, it ain't a fruit. It's fruit. Tomato is not a fruit. It's I a fruit. I've made them all my life. Si, just because you've eaten them, that doesn't mean it's that not don't a make fruit. it a vegetable. Hey, oh, yeah, it does. Hey, a peach is a fruit. A apple is a fruit. A tomato, that's the vegetable. Hey, what's inside a peach and an apple? Huh? A seed. What's inside a tomato? It's a vegetable. Oh, he got you on that. <laughs> he got you. Admit it. How do you mean he got you? Admit it. Just because it's got a seed in it? Yeah. The definition of a fruit. No. Well, grapes have got seeds in them. Hey. And it's a... It's a grape. It's a grape. I'm going with Martin on this one. What do you mean you're going with Martin? He's smarter than you. It's not a fruit. Oh, here Just we go. Just because it's got a seed, you call it a fruit? It's kind of the definition of it. That changes everything. Who put this on my desk? Oh, boy. <laughs> You found that? What's wrong with the girl's leg? Question for you. Yeah. Tomato, fruit or vegetable? All right. It's a vegetable. No, it's a fruit. It's a, fruit. It's a vegetable. All right, look, I got a specialty order I need done today. Look, if a tomato is a fruit, then a banana is a vegetable. It OK. Is, it is a fruit. But you but need work, to say, when work, I say work, work, what? You can work and talk at the same time. Hey, no. Work. What did he say? I don't know. My belly's growling. Let's go. I'm starved. Let's go. Get your tools. Let's get a cup of What are we going to do about that order, then? We'll do it on the way. It's a vegetable. <laughs> Boy, that more sweet as your mama's love. Ooh! Love. That baby there is worth 25 bucks. Where is this place? Well, you go down here. You know that pothole dried up? Pothole. You go past it, and then that fork and tree that the lightning struck about seven years ago with the dog pen under it, remember? No. There was a tire there one time. A tire? No, one of them hand tanner tires. A so tower? You got two cars and a dip. You don't remember any kind of street names or? It's about that barn. Barn? Now, there's some directions there. Well, you don't turn there. You keep going past it. Pull over. Uh-oh. Huh? Because I got to take a leak. Si, this is not a safe area. What are you going to do if you run into a bear? What do you think you're supposed to do, Si, while I'm looking this up? You pull your gun out and shoot him. Do not run. You can't outrun a bear. Don't even try it. I don't hate to outrun the bear. All I got to do is I outrun Galway. You think a little bear is going to stop me from taking a leak? I don't think so. Talk calmly so it knows you're a human. Hello, bear. Climb a tree if available. You're making that up. Everybody knows when you encounter a bear, all you got to do is run up and go, ah! And hey, he runs away. It's simple. Use your pepper spray. Make sure you spray this downwind. <laughs> or poop your pants. Look, there ain't an animal in the whole animal kingdom that will eat something and will poop all over it. Trust me, I know firsthand. Are you sure this is where you need to take a leak? <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying, right. there's I a bear what you cross no, inside right there, sir. I, I changed my mind. <laughs> I'll, I'll wait till I get to civilization. Boy, this is good. These are excellent tomatoes. And how about this ambiance? Do you know what ambiance is? No. 
Good idea, Godwin. Even though you lost me when you didn't eat anything with tomatoes in it. Because I got good chili dog. I need some more hot dogs. Well, you fellas, how y'all doing this evening? Oh, we're we're good, good, brother. We got a contest going here. Contest? With 10 hot dogs, two minutes, <laughs> you get a shirt. <laughs> two minutes is not long. You sure you can do that? Chili dogs, baby. Gawain is a real wild card. Somehow, he got us to the tomato place without any directions. Throw that hat in, I'll try. I can do that. <laughs> and after raving over their fried tomatoes, He's opting for chili dogs. A shirt. Nice. How about that? Bring on the dog. I'm going to go get you some dogs. You would think that engaging in a hot dog eating contest right after you've already eaten a couple chili dogs for lunch would be a bad idea. But this is Goblin we're talking about, after all. Goblin, there ain't no way. There they come. There you go. Woo! Ain't no way. 10 hot dogs, oh, two minutes. I'm ready. Go. Go. A record. Glory. T-shirt. Hat. We got a minute and a quarter left. He's halfway home, boy. Let's go, Gallon. Come on, buddy. He's slowing down, guys. 45 seconds. He's not going to make it. Uh-oh. He's beginning to sweat. More than normal. He fixes a blow, boys. This makes me want to vomit. Three, two, two one. one. Swallow it, Gowan. Do it. <laughs> oh, he did it. Wow. I need a bucket. How you feeling now? Starting to swell a little bit. Hey, where's my shirt? <laughs> oh. I found Thanks. your shirt. Yeah. So. I, I thought this was a rag. It was going to the bottom of the deck. Hey, you want this shirt? No. no Is your sure shirt no. here? You might want to wash that when you get home. No. I've lost every stinking shirt I've got from that place. Well, here, here. It could have been worse. Right. Could have had some boogers in it. And I'm hungry. Eat a tomato. You want to eat that thing like an apple? Right off the vine. Uh-oh. What? Your phone ringing. Yeah. We're almost there. I'm fixed to pull in the parking lot. So we've got tons of orders. Oh, he's outside, bro. This is kind of weird that I'm talking to you while I'm looking at you. So. I missed. He hung up on me. Oh. He was dodging a tomato. What seems to be the problem? Where have y'all been? On lunch break. You get a one hour lunch break. We've been in Vicksburg. Vicksburg? Mississippi. About five minutes ago, I realized that it had been a while since I had seen or heard any of the guys around the warehouse. Even Cy si wasn't in the bathroom like he normally is. So you drove an hour and a half there, an hour and a half back. Just more like two hours. Was I surprised they went to Vicksburg for lunch? Not really. Am I mad they did? Yes. You only do that on Saturday when you're not at work. We saved up our minutes. It's called rollover minutes. But not as mad as I was to find out they didn't bring me anything back. Word to the wise. Bring leftovers back for your boss if you take a long lunch break. That's just business 101. Did y'all forget about the order that I told you? No, hey, we look, got the we order, got the order done. Done. <laughs> Well, while you were gone, we got about eight more orders. We'll do them tomorrow. If you're going to take five-hour lunch breaks, now you got to stay five hours extra. But that time was owed us. Yeah, it's called rollover minutes. Goblin, what are you doing with a stupid hat on? I want it. Eating jelly dough. I don't know if that's the look you need. Have a tomato. They're fresh. Now, y'all gonna get these orders done tonight. Well, you're gonna pay us overtime. I ain't paying you're you You're buying crap. supper. If I'm working overtime, you're buying supper. Y'all eat them tomatoes for supper. You're a terrible boss. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Roll it up. Uh -oh. Roll it up. Oh, oh, God. Crap, that got me. Good grief. Well, boy, I'd like to bust you the window. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> you like that again, dummy? 